So, when do you think this denial phase of yours is gonna come to an end? What? What are you waiting for, Stefan? A breakdown? I'm teary, emotional, I'm sorry, it's all my fault. Well, you're gonna be waiting a long time, bro. Yeah, you know, I just refuse to believe that you care so little about your own flesh and blood. Why is that? Death doesn't erase all the crappy things she did, Stefan. <sighs> if anything, it lets me care about her even less. Mm. Oh. Hello, boys. If you'll just pardon me a moment. What are you doing? I seem to have misplaced my cellular telephone. These things have a way of, you know, jumping out of your hand and just scurrying off. Ah, oh, stop looking. Here it is. Well, I feel stupid. I know you feel stupid. Hmm. Because, see, Stefan and I thought you had some really great maniacal plan, but turns out you're just a drunk sorority girl who ruins everyone's night by losing her cell phone. Well, it has been a rough few weeks for all of us, I suppose, after what we went through. We? Hmm. What do you mean by we? Well, you lost your mother, and I lost the love of my life. She meant nothing to you. She meant everything to me! Do you remember this sword when you, you know, drove it through my chest? You didn't quite have all the pieces together, though, did you? Literally. See, when a vampire is stabbed through the heart with the completed sword, it acts as a magical conduit, transferring their spirit into this particularly nasty stone. And the purpose of the stone is to punish vampires like you boys. Every sin you've committed goes into creating your own little personal hell. Well, I spent over a hundred years trapped inside. A hundred. And Lily saved me. And for the briefest of moments, I had her back in my life. She was the only thing that kept the madness of the stone at bay, you know, the only thing that kept me sane. Wait, that was you sane? Well, it was. But, uh, now? These have been dark days for me. So they followed him to Ridley Park, Old Saybrook, and finally Sunbury. They need to leave immediately. Julian is not one who enjoys solitude. Those towns are places he used to live. And then I remembered what my old life looked like. And I, I, I realized... I mean, it was a good life. I was surrounded by the people that I cared about. My friends. Two, two. 